the ponies are so beautiful and yeah, it's, it's just wild to see them. So I first saw them. uh, So before they can do the swim, which is Mm -hmm. what is, you know, written about in Misty of Chincoteague, where they swim from Assateague Island, which um, for your listeners who don't know, it's kind of, it's a wildlife refuge. And there is a herd of about 150, um, mostly mares, but about maybe 20 stallions. And Mm -hmm. um, so every year, when the foals are born, obviously they don't want the island to overpopulate. So they do this swim in July, toward the end of July. And it is a swim where the saltwater cowboys, who are volunteer fire fighters on Chincoteague Island, uh, basically are herding the stallions and mares and foals through the water from Assateague Island to Chincoteague Island. What a lot of people don't realize is they kind of do a vet check before the swim. Mm -hmm. So if there's a foal that is too tiny or maybe a horse that's older and isn't looking like they could make the swim, Mm -hmm. you know, Mm -hmm. in great fashion or um, a mare that's too pregnant, they'll be trailered over. But anyway, so I first saw them in one of the kind of holding corrals prior to the swim. Mm -hmm. And it was a thrill to I've never been that close to wild horses before. Mm 